Please, someone describe what we're watching, please. I'm not watching that. That was that was racist. As um, basically, an activist in uh, Washington D.C. He wants people to come out and get vaccinated, and if you get vaccinated, he'll give you a joint. Would that convince you? Um, me? Are you gonna get vaccinated? Nah, man, I'm, I'm straight, man. I, I, I played <laughs> enough video games and shit. I'm good, man. <laughs> what does that mean? <laughs> man, I, I, I played Resident Evil. I know how this shit ends. <laughs> I'm good with that shit. I mean, look, 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 that's a healthy, healthy skepticism as a black man in this country. So I respect that. I wouldn't trust that stuff either. All right. I, I feel I understand what you're saying, Jarvis. I understand what you're saying. So you getting vaccinated? No, okay. I don't want to. That's good. But but, but nah. I think I might. Nah, I might. Like, you know how you know how I'm going to get vaccinated? Because I'm like, I'm such a pushover when it comes to like doctors and stuff. Like they usually when I go to the doctors, like, we should uh, we should do like an extra test thing. I'm like, all right, sounds about good. You're the doctor. You fit. You know what you're talking about. So if I ever go to the doctor and he's like, you know what, we have a we have one extra shot. You want it? I'll probably say yeah because if if I say no, my doctor's gonna think I'm a fucking idiot, and then he's not gonna want to take care of me later in life. So like, well, bro, you the you the you the right one that they be looking for because that's based on them just charging that insurance more. That's why they be trying to get you to work. Mm -hmm, that's mm -hmm. just like going to that's just like going to get your oil changed and then they tell you everything else that ain't wrong with the car that you might want to fix right now. They what seven hundred dollars more? You want me to? I came in here for a fucking oil change, <laughs> not a new car. They put I, they put a fucking uh, uh, air fresh around my neck after I'm done. Yeah. And then pat you on the ass and say, good game. I mean, look, I'm not, look, I'm just going to be honest. I don't pay for my insurance. Like, it's all paid for. Why am I not going to take the extra butthole test or something? You know what I'm saying? I'm going to do it. Just play with my butthole. Yeah, go ahead. You do that. But um, no, man, it, I think it's a very uh, <laughs> ingenious way of listening. Listen, listen, way. listen, listen, listen. If I, I know Spence knows. When we get to the age, which is coming up, I think, I think, if I don't know if it's next year or a couple of years from now, but when we get our, when we have to go get a process check, we're still doing that together. That is a promise that we made at, at 15 years old. So you could say, oh, you could look, you could look down on me all you want about my butt, I'm but not, we're going to go I'm together. Looking, I'm not looking down on you, but you ain't at the age to be talking about getting your butt done. So if you, if you, yeah, huh, it's 35. About, no, it's not. I swear it's to God. It's not I swear 35. to God. Look it up. It's Google. not, it's not, it's going to say the new recommended, but it's not 35. What am I not? A, I'm not a doctor. I'm not. I don't know when I'm going to follow the recommendation. It's for going to make up my own number. Look, prostate exam. Ag, American Cancer Society. What age? Oh, look, look, go to the bottom. Go to the go back and then click the bottom thing. Age 50 for Bam. men. I was 45, 40. Thank 40. you. Thank so, okay, you. Okay, we got five years. We got five years. Some of us. But, so but, others, but, but, other but, of us. But time, but, but time out. Y'all going for, I don't know. I don't, I don't know if y'all going for the joke or not, but that just shows you who the fuck knows what the fuck is going on and who doesn't. Cause you motherfuckers talking about 35. So what the fuck y'all waiting for then? If, if it's look, 35. Look, now look what it says. Look what it says. It says age 40. Those are first degree relative who had prostate cancer. 45. The developing process includes African Americans and men who have first degree relative father or brother diagnosed with prostate cancer. I, I, I know all this, so uh, answer my question. <laughs> are we gonna go or are we not gonna go? That's my question. No, uh, I, I want to know. Was y'all trying to go for the joke and try to get me or some shit? Because if it's thirty five, what the fuck are y'all waiting for? If it's if we go right now, if I call my doctor tomorrow and say, "Hey, can we come in?" and he'll be like, "Yeah, this is about right." And if he does that, are you coming? <laughs> are you coming with me? No, no, it's not my time to go. <laughs> See, now, now you're making up rules now, man. We're How supposed to go. Up, to I'm making up the rules, and we looking at this shit right on the screen. I'm not making up the fucking rules. It's saying it right down the motherfucking screen. For all right, so so then so I'm gonna, so we gotta wait till forty then. Because you're older than me, so you're gonna be forty first. So are you gonna wait check, an extra check. an extra two years for me? Check this shit out. I got no problem with getting my prostate checked because I don't want to fucking die of prostate <laughs> cancer. All the so motherfuckers that so let's go now. Tested, so, that's their problem. So let's go now. Let's go next. Week. I'm not going to. It's recommended for me to go. <laughs> there, there is no, there is no rush for me to go in there and get my my butt played with and somebody talking to me about the game Man, last night. Yo, I saw on the news. I saw on the news. Uh, <laughs> some dude. Some dude. <laughs> Some dude killed his doctor because he made him <laughs> orgasm when he checked his prostate. 
That, 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 shit. Knows, that, ain't his, that ain't his first time. <laughs> Fuck, man, that shit, that shit killed me when I read that. He's pulling it up. I sort of got it. So I heard it on the news. It's fucking. He was like, "How dare you make me feel anything like that?" And he fucking came back and shot the goddamn doctor. <laughs> <laughs> so like Jacksonville man, Jacksonville man shot a male doctor for making him come during frosty. What? What is this? This isn't a real fucking website. <laughs> what is this? Yeah, dude. That shit's not, that shit's not incredible. <laughs> <laughs> okay, the LA Times. The LA Times. That, I thought that, that shit said the, the Himalayan news. <laughs> it did. <laughs> <laughs> oh, fuck, man. But I mean, that's, I think the funniest thing for me is like that dude, what he must have thought, what his thought process was while that happened. <laughs> he came, <laughs> getting a doctor checkup. <laughs> he lost his damn mind. Hey, but time out. Nah, Ooh. it's going to. I, I haven't talked to anybody who, who actually got it, but I mean, are, are, is he mad if it's coming? Cause I'm waiting for the doctor to say, oh, it might be coming or some shit like that. What do you mean? Uh, what do you mean? That, it, it, uh, like if they tell you beforehand, hey, you might ejaculate when I check your prostate. <laughs> like, is that, a, is that a warning? <laughs> That's what I'm saying. I don't know anybody who's done it, so I haven't asked them. Hey, did the doctor ever say if they once they check your prostate, you might bust a nut? I haven't asked anybody that shit yet. We're, but knowing that, I wonder if that's a side effect. I, I mean, we're we're gonna find out. We're gonna find out. Yeah. So, uh huh. Yeah. We, so 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 be ready, bro. Be ready. Oh, that that ready booty. I can be. That booty. Keep that booty tight, son. You don't keep it loose. What the fuck? I'm not going to get ready for that shit. <laughs> I said keep it tight. I said keep it loose. That's what I'm saying. I'm not going at all out. I'm tight as fuck. I'm not going in that shit. Ready? I'm tight as fuck. What the fuck? <laughs> Y'all gonna be trying to figure out why the fuck I'm outside sucking up air and shit. I'm getting my lungs ready. I'm trying to hold this shit when I get in. Yo, it's so crazy because like, I, I'm never going to be ready for that that visit i'm never gonna be ready it's gonna be awkward no matter what no matter how cool the doctor's like listen listen son i've done this millions of times <laughs> it's not gonna make me feel any better I, and i, I, I don't want him to talk i don't want him to talk i don't want to talk i don't want to talk That's it. i don't i don't want to talk i don't i don't want to feel i don't want to feel like their body like on my shoulder like like over me or anything like just just go in there, reach for what you got to reach for, and get out of there. Let's go. <laughs> like, I don't even want to think about it. I just want to, like, let my mind just, like, go away. Just go in there with headphones on. <laughs> and, like, I don't I don't want him to, like, have cream that makes the fart noise at the end. Like, he, <laughs> well, like he put it on, he puts the cream, like, he puts the cream on his two fingers, and, it, and then he go, right, I'm like, oh, man, here we go. <laughs> I'm gonna be holding the shit out of my bro, bro. That shit gone. You know what's gonna be hilarious though? You're gonna make like a uh, you're gonna make like a an internal noise that you can't help. Like you're not yeah. gonna be able to help yeah. it. So it's yeah. gonna be one of those like, <laughs> yeah. like one of those that's what it's gonna be. And then like I'm gonna have to go to the to the emergency room because something inside of me just popped. <laughs> so they gotta do emergency surgery from a guy that got his prostate check. <laughs> 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 oh, fuck. Woo. First time ever. And then they're gonna try to interview me at the same uh, Fuck no, nah, you ain't interviewing me, news channel. Get the fuck out of here. <laughs> I just got an emergency room to get my prostate checked. Oh my fuck, god. I don't want to be on the fucking news for that shit. Oh dude, that's so fucking great.